What's up, family? It's your boy V Cherry Jr. Vinny Mac Kizzle Cherry Boy Live. You know it don't matter, right? But yeah, I was tagged by my friend Rob G, aka RG Man 66, in a game that's been going on called Four Truths and One Lie. And I was actually tagged like almost a couple months ago, and I just found out about it. Man, I'm goofy. Anyway, but alright, here's the way it goes, alright? You yeah, you, uh, you tell everybody like four true things about yourself and just one one false thing, one lie. So let's get started. Four truths and one lie. Yeah, let's get started. Let's do it. Let's be fine. Yeah. When I was like two or three, I was watching a bunch of Eddie Murphy movies like Beverly Hills Cop, uh, Coming to America, and I and I I was I couldn't stop cussing. I, I mean, I'd be walking around the house all day, every day, just cussing. And I was on, only like two or three years old. You know, my mom and my dad, they, they would take me to the grocery store, and I'd just be cussing, like, you, you, nothing, you, nothing. Just all kind of bad language. And, you know, she, my mom told me people would be looking at her like, what kind of little crazy demon baby you got there? You better do something about that. You know, so trust. My parents did get a hold of me, and uh, I couldn't watch, like, another Eddie Murphy movie, like, for a few more years. <laughs> when I was, like, 13 or 14, uh, my mom and dad, sister, everybody, we, we were all visiting this hotel. And my mom saw the singer Lou Rawls, you know, the legendary Lou Rawls. And, you know, she's like, you see that? that that's Lou Rawls. I was like, who? You know, <laughs> I didn't know who Lou Rawls was. But, you know, uh, we met him, talked to him, and, you know, he was real, he was cool, you know. And uh, he, he actually gave me some kind of handshake. I remember he, he said something to me like, stay positive, stay in school, and keep yourself together. Or something like that. Something along those lines. And, you know, ever since then, I've, I've always been fascinated with Lou Rawls. You know, uh, you know, even though he passed away a few years ago, but yeah, I've, I've always been fascinated with him ever since then. I've never learned, nor do I know how to swim. Uh, my family, we got to meet Destiny's Child before they got famous, you know, like back in 95 or something, six, I was like eight or something years old back then, but you know, they, they you know, but I had a crush on all these, these girls back then, you know, cause you know, I saw that they had talent. And you know, it's like, I knew that they, they was gonna make it, you know. Uh, a few years ago, MTV had a show called Yo Mama. Uh, you, you might remember, you know, but uh, like, but a few years ago, they came to my school, uh, and you know, they were looking for like, young people to like, do the Yo Mama thing, like, you know, like battle each other. And uh, you know, and I auditioned for it, actually, and, uh, and I actually, I did pretty good. I was actually, you know, the crowd was laughing at my comebacks and my jokes, and you know, I, you know they said I did pretty good. And I had a real good chance of making it, but I think my comebacks might not have been that quick. They might not have been quick enough, you know, because I was like, uh, yo mama so, uh, that she, you know, but I was, I was like too slow with it, you know. But it was still a cool experience. So, 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 do you really feel like you can figure out which one is the lie? Go ahead and take a guess. And I, I put the answers in another video. So I have to tag a few people to keep this going, okay? So everyone I've tagged, I've put their channels down in the description box. Okay, so, uh, you know, whosoever's name is in there, I mean, they've been tagged, all right? And you know, you guys, whoever I tag, you don't have to do it if you don't want to, but I want you to. <laughs> so I want, I want you to, so please. Okay, so thank you guys for watching. It's your boy, Cherry Boy Live. Love y'all, man, and peace.